Question 10. Point F is 3 units left and 1 unit above C. How can you conclude that how can you conclude that from their ordered pairs? Okay. So, we see point F is 3 units left and 1 unit above C. So, it is 3 units left. 1, 2, 3 units left and 1 unit above C. How can you conclude that from their ordered pairs? I hope you understand. Sorry for the misprint. Okay. So, how can you conclude from their ordered pairs that F is 3 units left and 1 unit above? To answer this question, what should you do? Write down their ordered pairs. Let's write down. F is minus 3 and 4. How about C? C is 0 and 3. Now, if you have to go from C to F, then horizontally you have to move from 0 to 3 minus. That means minus means 3 units left, correct? And then, vertically you have to move from 3 to 4, 1 unit above. Do you see that? That is how we conclude. So, if you have to move from C to F, then how will you do? So, horizontally, you will go left, 3 units. 0 to, you will go from 0 to minus 3. That means left, 3 units, correct? And vertically, from 3 to 4, 3 to 4, that means up 1 unit. Do you understand? This is kind of transformation and will help you when we talk about transformation of points and how the two points can be at the same point or how can we bring one point to the other point, things like that. Okay. Now, relate points B and C in a similar fashion. Okay. B and C is here. B is here, right? So, from B to C. We have to relate them. So, what are the coordinates of point B? So, write down coordinates for point B. So, B is always x first, minus 3 and minus 4. How about C? C is 0 and 3. Now, if you have to go from B to C, how do you go? Think like this. So, it is minus 3 to 0. That means 3 units right. Let's go. 1, 2, 3 units right. And from 3 to minus 4, we'll make first 3 to 0 and 0 to... Oh, okay. Uh, sorry. We'll go from B to C, right? So, from B to C, 3 units right. From minus 3 to 0, we are going 3 units right. So, that is 1, 2, 3. And then from minus 4 to 3. Minus 4 to 3 means 0 in between. So, 4 to 0 is 4 units and then 3, 7 units. So, say 1, 2, 3, 4, you come to 0, 5, 6, 7. Do you see that? So, you will go 3 units right and 7 units up. So, that is how they are related. Now, for you as an exercise, you can figure out how will you go from A to G, right? So, you can think how are points A and G related or point F and G related, okay? You can think of it. So, from F to G, correct? Find out how will you relate them with their ordered pairs. That should be a good exercise for you. Thank you.